unlock the power of coding to automate your AutoCAD designs. I will show you how to speed up your workflow and enhance precision. The language is Python. The library is EasyDXF. The AutoCAD entities this time is Dimensions. Let's dive in. I would start by importing the SDXF library. Then, create a DXF document with version 2010 and a standard setup. Now I want to access the model space and add a new dimension entity. Let's do a horizontal linear dimension first by calling the add linear dim function, specify the base, first point and second point. It's similar to how you do it in AutoCAD, you specify two points and the line location, base point. Save the file and hit the run button. As you can see, a new linear dimension is created. I can use rotated dimension by specifying the angle. Hit run and note the difference. Now I will add a new line and make the dimension aligns with that line. Note. I have changed the function to add aligned dim, and instead of user base, here I need to specify a vertical distance from the measured line. Run the code. You can see the generated dimension is now aligned to a line. Let's go back to the linear dimension and play with the code. I will use override and specify where you want the dimension text appear in relation to the dimension line. Number four is the option to get text below the line, as you can see after running the code. Note the difference. If I change it to zero, the text goes in the middle of the line. I can specify the text height using the dim text t attribute. Let's check the difference. I can change the color. The value one here represents the red color. Let's clear the override attribute and I will add a background fill to the text with a color as well. Isn't that cool? You can, in fact, override the text with whatever you want. If I say text equals specific text, say greater than 200 millimeters, and then run the code, the new text will replace the original dimension text. Before I finish, I am going to show you how you can actually change the properties of extension lines. You can change the color, change the type of first line and change the type of second line. Let's hit run and see the output. If the change is not visible when you try, go to the dimension properties and check the changes there. Thank you.